soon pregnant. What? What happened? <laughs> Team B was definitely cheated at the end of this challenge. Hi everyone, thank you so much for clicking on this video. If you're new here, my name is Rhonda and this is Talks with Rhonda. This is another vlog in which I show you my life as an HSC student and as a member of the student council. So make yourself comfortable and enjoy. So Monday is usually the day where I'm the most free, so I get to enjoy my office. And I share this office with the president of the student council and I'm the vice president. And right now I'm heading out because I have a class and I don't want to be late. So I was actually able to make it early to my class. It was my governance in Africa class, which is my last class on Mondays. So after this class, I quickly rushed to my room to freshen up and, you know, get something to eat. And by 7 p.m., I was back on campus for my ASC meetings. You can see how exhausted I look, but I really enjoy my student council meetings. Um, this is where we usually plan events and anything the student council has to handle. We actually had an event that night, uh, which was in collaboration with a new restaurant on the hill and um this is actually the restaurant is called casabella so all students were invited to come for you know a tasting as they were opening the place was packed so yeah that's how my monday went so at Ashesi, at least twice in a semester we have something we call the academic break which is organized by the provost office where we get to network and hang out with the whole community for 15 minutes i believe over iced tea some cakes some biscuits and some juice and this is the juice i picked um it's made with the carambola fruit i think it's also known as star fruit it was really nice i recommend it there was a special performance by the Ashesi choir and it started drizzling so i had to rush to class so after class i met with my group because we didn't want to take our assignments home so we went in the corridor to just quickly finish the assignments and yeah that was my day so i was making my way back to my room took a shower had something to eat and um, now i was taking some time to work on my CV and that's the wrap for Tuesday. It's a new day and one thing that has really changed since my last Ashesi vlog is that we have so many new businesses on the hill. Guys, please let me know in the comments below if you'd be interested in me telling you more about where to get what at Ashesi. And this is my Wednesday outfit. Um, I'm wearing my usual school bag with a white top. And I'm wearing jeans even though you can't see them right now. Um, and these earrings were actually a gift by a friend of mine. And if she's okay with it, I'll put her link in the description in case you want to know more about it. So after class, I went to grab lunch with Lovely. And hmm, guys, there's a whole backstory to this lunch, but you find out about it very soon. Lopi, what are you doing? I'm giving you the gari, the plantains that have gari on them because I don't want it. Oh, okay. And then you take mine that do not have. Okay, I think all of yours are now. They're fine? Uh, no, okay. So guys, this today was supposed to be, today's Wednesday, and today was supposed to be Banku Wednesday. Banku Wednesday, but Madame here decided she didn't want to eat Banku. So we're doing Gobe Wednesday yes. instead of Banku Wednesday. So I'm pregnant. What? What happened? <laughs> 
<laughs> you see that friend that you know makes you come out of your shell that's what lovely is to me anyways we have to eat quite fast because we had a lot to do on that day uh, we had an assignment to submit and then we also had a quiz coming up so everybody got to work so guys if you want to come to Ashesi, if Ashesi is your dream school yes the campus is nice and everything but the workload hmm, just prepare yourself for the workload because it's a lot <laughs> Bye, lovely. So, unlike Lovely, I had one last class, but it wasn't too long. Uh, how was school today? Hmm, it's not easy at all, guys. But, anyways, that was my day. So it's Friday afternoon and we just stepped out of possibly the hardest quiz we had to take this semester. But we moved. So we were headed to the gym to meet a couple of friends and we were very excited about that. Yeah, Friday turned out to be a very fun day. So on our way to the gym, I passed by the Ashesi workshop to check on a project that the ASC was partnering to work on. This is the workshop, but I'll give you a full tour very, very soon, so don't worry. This is part of the project. Um, it's basically a bin, but yeah, it's a very, very creative project and they did a very, very great job. I'm going to show you the full thing, but while we were there, we saw another really cool project that a friend was doing for their capstone and it's a car. So that was really cool. So yeah, now we were heading to the gym. Lovely wanted me to show you guys that she and Prince are wearing the same shorts. So there you go. Are you happy? Yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the gym, guys. So once we got there, we started kind of deliberating on the plan, what we would do. And we decided to pick a team randomly between team A and team B. Um, basically for the best team to win. So this whole thing was planned out by Mansa, who is also a content creator. So I've put the link to her YouTube channel in the description box below. Hi, I'm Mansa and I'm on Team B. I definitely think that Laurel is going to tap out first and because she ain't even looking before coming. And my biggest strength is that I'm the only one amongst these people that actually gyms consistently. Wow. Hi, I'm Anama and I'm on Team B. And I think that Laurel on Team A is going to talk about this. Biggest strength. I'm very competitive. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jessie, I'm in Team B. And I believe that we are going to win. And I think Laurel is the one who going to talk about this. Because she ain't before coming. And I think my biggest strength is the fact that I am really determined. Everyone thinks I'm going to talk about this, but I'm going to put them on. A few moments later. Hi. 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 My name is Laurel. Mm -hmm. And I don't think I'm going to tap out face. But everyone thinks it's not my full tap out face. Trust me. And um, biggest strength. Um, and. <laughs> I don't want to tell me. But. Well, let's see. Hi, so my name is Rhonda and I'm in Team A. I don't know who to talk about, but I just know my team will win. Mm -hmm. Please. Yeah. Biggest yeah. strength. My biggest strength, I'm, you know, I bring the vibes, you know. Woo! Albert, and I'm part of Team A. Yeah. So I'm really trying this. I think I'm good at everything. Oh. And who do you think is going to tap out first? Definitely Team Nanama. Because she's ah. not a little girl. Hi, okay, my name is Jigo. I'm the Jimmy Shaka for today. Yeah. What is your biggest strength? <laughs> um, who do you think will tap out first? Jesse. <laughs> Honestly, it's Jesse. Ronda will give out in the house. So Jesse will tap out in the Yeah, Jesse will tap out in the TV. Hmm, the shade, guys, the shade. 
Anyways, Jigo was out here showing off and showing us that he was the strongest among us all. In the meantime, I was having a very important and secretive conversation with Lovely. After thoughts, we decided to have the competition outside on the grass. I'm allergic to grass! <laughs> so as you can see, we're not all on the same page about that. But while we were setting up, me, I was preparing my surprise backup plan, my surprise missile, my surprise bomb. Yes. Hello, my name is Lovely and I'm Rhonda's stunt double and I think <laughs> Jesse the Witch will tap out first. <laughs> <laughs> Call it whatever you want, cheating or maybe being incredibly smart. So you see, for example, this playing challenge, me, I knew I stood no chance, so I asked my stun double to do it. And of course, I was cheering for her the whole time, and she won! I was stun double. I think team B was definitely cheated at the end of this challenge, and I think I was supposed to win. So for this challenge, they refused to let me use my stun double. Can you imagine? Anyways, as you can see, I was trying my best. Are you ready? Three, two, one. One. Two. Faster. Four. I tried my best, but I couldn't kill myself. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bet said, hey, my team. <laughs> So as you all heard, Team A actually won, but Team B decided to come and oppose. So, um, Team B, eh, they are all cheating. They are all saying that, oh, that eh, our swarm is this, our swarm is that. But there, there's no basis, there's no scientific basis to say that our swarm was not good enough. After much deliberation, we decided to just let them take the win, and we moved up to the. <laughs> Sorry, guys, I watched it myself trying to do this thing. They call it up down plank or something like that, guys. Mm. It's okay. It's okay. I tried. Hey, okay. Why are you not happy for us? The whole point of the video. So, so the win. end of that round also led to a disagreement. But while we were all fighting, Alpes was just chilling. So, anyways, since we were the more mature and secure team. We decided to let Team B take the win and called it a day. We had a wonderful time and it was an amazing experience. And I definitely think we should do this again sometime. My evening did not end here, guys. I had an ASC event to attend and you guys are definitely coming with me. So let's go. So this was a debate slash trivia event to foster more diversity and inclusivity on our campus um, and it was done by the cohesion committee. <laughs> It was really my kind of event. There was even a live artist that was making paintings right under our noses, guys. It was as tired as I was. Honestly, I wouldn't have missed this for anything in the world. Also, I made a friend and we joined the Kahoots together and we ended up second. But for some reason, in the very ending, we were third. Anyways, we're not sorry losers. We're happy to be on the top three. And yeah. So this
this is it guys this is the end of this vlog thank you guys so much for watching this video until the end let me know of your comments questions or anything else or in the comment section below and please don't forget to share and subscribe as always keep feeling and flowing and i'll see you next time on talks with Rhonda. bye